Hey everybody, I'm here today to talk to you about the real reason why car accidents happen. In this video, I'll be going over one of the main reasons why car accidents happen. Now, let's get right to the point. The real reason why car accidents happen is human error. It's humans, us humans, making bad decisions while driving. Now, is this the reason why every car accident happens? No, but I can say that probably over 99% of car accidents have a human error contribution, meaning a human error at least contributed to part of the reason for why the car accident happened. So let's go over some of the main reasons why car accidents happen. Well, a lot of the times, <clears throat> drivers follow too closely and this usually isn't a problem in you know regular road conditions like right now I'm dry I'm driving on dry pavement you know the Sun is to my side you know in regular road conditions ideal road conditions I should say it's not really a huge problem but it seems like as soon as it starts to rain or snow or it's foggy or the Sun is shining in your eyes whenever there is something that turns it into an unideal or a road condition that is not ideal it seems seems that drivers keep that same following distance when they should actually increase the following distance. So that is a human error. Now if you're following too closely or if someone is following too closely to the car in front of them and they end up rear-ending that car or, or getting into an accident because they're following too closely or if following too closely at least contributed to the accident in one way or another, guess what? That is human error. If they could have left a greater following distance but they decided to follow too closely, that's human error. One of the main reasons right there. Another reason, people drive too fast. And like I said, it's usually not a problem when the road conditions are ideal when it's dry you know and it's not snowing it's not raining everything's good people seem to drive the speed limit for the most part you know some people drive a little bit over a little bit under but for the most part everyone drives at a relatively safe speed but when it starts to snow I live in Canada I live in Toronto Canada and we do get a lot of snow here in the winter um, when it snows it usually snows pretty heavily and when it starts to snow and get icy all of a sudden everyone seems like they're, they're on, on a racetrack right they drive too fast for the snow for the road conditions and guess what when they take a turn too fast and the car spins out and they go into a light post whose fault is that that's a human error because they could have driven a little bit slower I can go on and on and on for for a long time about the main reasons um, uh, the main human errors that that cause these car accidents because there are so many right there are so many things that people can do there you know they're on there they're, they're they're extremely distracted and they're swerving and they sideswipe a car they don't make certain that there's no oncoming traffic before they make a left across an intersection and they get hit because they basically turned in front of a car right they don't pay attention to the proper rules of the right of way and then you know they go at the wrong time and they hit each other because some they weren't sure about the right of way like I can go on and on and on and on and on but what it comes down to is this human error is and probably will be for a very long time the real reason why car accidents happen now there is a small percentage of car accidents I would say well under 1% of car accidents that happen because of something that is just completely not in your control. You're driving down the street and you know a light post just just falls in front of your car or a tree just falls in front of your car and, and you end up getting into an accident with the tree with the light post whatever the case is right or swerving and get, getting into an accident to avoid hitting that light post. There are things that happen that are completely not in your control and humans do make good decisions oftentimes in those situations but that's less than 1% of, of the accidents we're talking about when I'm talking about 99 plus percent of accidents I'm speaking about just pure raw human error and it's as simple as that and I just wanted to make this video to tell you about the real reason why car accidents happen and that's it I really hope you've enjoyed this little relatively quick and simple video if you like the video be sure to give it a thumbs up let me know what you think down below as a comment and of course be sure to subscribe for more great car and driving videos just like this one and that's all I have for you today thanks for watching